Well, I've had quite a few memorable moments uh, service in my community. If I had to put my finger on the one, it would be when COVID first hit, uh, I had a foster care transition to home that I was selling. And in the midst of that ordeal, I had to relocate my kids that were within my program and within other programs who needed housing. So I had to get out uh, the relationships that I had built over the years, had to make some phone calls. And I saw a community of business leaders come together and provide housing for these young people who in the midst of COVID, when it first hit, we didn't know what was going on. Fully furnished homes, homes in gated communities. I mean, we're not talking about shoes or clothes. We're talking about actual homes. From the relationships that I've built, I saw men come together and provide these services for free for almost a year. And it was unbelievable to be able to witness that. Uh, my good friend, Ralph Chancey, was at the head of that. Uh, he's passed away in this past year. So I just, you know, give him honor and, and respect for what he did for those young people. Possibly it was over eight kids uh, that needed housing in a matter of 48 hours. And he made it happen with multiple properties that our family would be grateful for Ralph Chancey and what he was able to uh, accomplish, help me accomplish uh, getting housing for those kids.